Hey love, so today we're gonna do my first fall clothing haul of 2018. I am so excited, so excited. Boohoo is one of my absolute favorite brands to order from. I've done a couple videos with them where they supply the clothing. I do want you guys to know that this haul, I purchased all of the clothing with my own money. But as always, everything will be linked down below and there are affiliate links down below, so use them if you would like to. It would mean the world because it does let Boohoo know that I sent you, but if you don't want to, totally cool, no pressure. Whew, okay, I have just tried on so many clothes so many clothes i tried on all of the boohoo haul and then i have a rose gal haul coming so if i seem a little extra sleepy i have been trying on clothes for hours all right so anyway we're gonna jump into this haul i'm sure you saw the thumbnail i'm so excited about this haul honestly i'm gonna tell you right now i loved literally everything everything so excited anyway i'm gonna stop rambling and start showing you guys the good stuff so let's jump into this haul please subscribe if you have not already i upload videos every monday wednesday friday here on my channel usually uploading more i'm doing about four videos a week right now four to five videos so definitely subscribe especially if you are into plus size fashion content we got lots of that going on here and so many hauls to come all right let's do this Okay, as always, I'm about an 1820. I do find that Boohoo usually runs on the more generous of the sizing. So I decided to purchase pretty much all, I think I got all 18s in one 16. The 16 I only got because it's all there was available. I was ordering all 20s, but I was noticing it was like too loose in the bus and stuff. So I decided to wing it and go with an 18. And honestly, everything worked out really, really well. I am 5'9", and when I go to Torrid, just for reference, I usually purchase a two, and my jeans from Torrid are a size 18, but my jeans from pretty much everywhere else are a size 20. Let's do this. Girl, so when I think of fall, I think of mustard, I think of like maroon, I think of olive green, I think of burnt pumpkin. Like those are my like go-to fall colors. And I saw this little tank top. Oh girl, she all messed up. What is this called? This is the Plus Ditsy Floral Swing Cami in yellow. And this is a US size 18, a UK 22. Uh, so she's kind of short, but honestly, once I put her on, I really didn't even mind. Plus, I got this with the idea in mind that I was going to tuck it into a skirt, which you'll probably see me wearing in the try-on, and I'll, you know, I'll show you the skirt next. I just love the mustard and the black and white. I just love, I love Ditsy print. I just love it. I think it's so cute. Super cozy. Like, it fits really nicely. Um, it's not too low where I feel like my bra is going to pop out, but I don't know. It's just, it's kind of basic, but it's super cute. Everything on Boohoo is always such a good deal. They always have 40, 50, 60% off all of these crazy deals. So you can never go wrong. I think I paid like eight bucks for this or something ridiculous. And of course I'll have it linked below. Everything in this haul, super affordable. That's what I love about Boohoo. It's like, I feel like I'm getting really good quality for the price. There are certain sites out there where you're going to get a really good price, but then you're going to kind of get what you pay for. I feel like Boohoo, most of the time you really get like better quality than what you pay for. Pretty generous on their sizing. Like this tank top, I probably could have gone down a size if I really wanted to, but I do like the looser fit and I do want it to kind of billow out a little bit when I tuck it into the skirt. Let's look at the skirt, you guys. She's so cute. Okay, so she's this little, what color are they calling this? A, a berry. This is a berry skirt. This I did get in a 20 just because anytime I've gotten any sort of skirt like this, um, I don't have good luck with it. But to my surprise, it was actually pretty stretchy. I mean, I probably could have gotten an 18, uh, but I'm glad I got the 20, at least for right now. It's a little stretchy cord skirt and it's got the little zipper. She fits really good. I mean, for where I want her to sit on my belly, it is pretty short. But I'm gonna wear it with some like full coverage tights, most likely, um, and try and like pull it down a little bit. Uh, but I, I just, there's a certain point on my belly, like right above my roll, where I do like for things to sit. So, I mean, it does work. It just is a little shorter than I'm accustomed to, but if for certain occasions or whatever I decide to wear it for, it'll be fine. Plus, I'll just wear some some thick tights underneath, maybe some shorts, uh, so I won't be showing my booty. I'll be very cautious not to bend over. Um, I like how the bottom edge is frayed. I just love the skirt. It's covered in cat hair already, so I'm definitely gonna have to lint roll it. That's the only downside. Uh, again, I love the color. I think they have this in a different color as, as well. I don't remember what color um, it also came in, but I know they had like a mustard yellow one too. I don't know if it was the same style or what, but now I'm like not near as scared of these skirts. And I honestly was so worried that this was gonna just show every lump and bump and look terrible. And honestly, when I looked in the mirror, I mean, I don't know what it looks like in the try-on, but it wasn't that bad. I honestly, like any other time I've tried on a skirt like this, it just was not flattering. But something about the way this one is cut, it actually does flare out. I feel like so many, maybe because they're normally from cheaper brands like Shein, where it's just kind of a column and it doesn't account for hips. And I feel like Boohoo does account for curves. Sometimes too much when it comes to the bust, but I got a lot of booty. So I'm glad when they account for the booty and the hip curves. So definitely a win, win and win. I love these two together. So cute. 
I did get a couple cardigans, so we're gonna start with the olive green one. Let me see what this guy is called. This is the Plus Boyfriend Knitted Cardigan in Khaki. This one again is in a size US 18, UK 22. Uh, so cozy, so cozy. It's definitely oversized. I got this in gray last year. Um, I, think it's, I think it's the exact same cardigan, I'm pretty sure, and I think it's still available in gray and maybe other colors. That's what I love. A lot of their items come in different colors. Um, so whatever you're kind of feeling. So many cute cardigans. I cannot wait for them to get the rest of their fall stuff in. Uh, but I have this in gray and I got the 20 last year and the 20 felt like even a little too big. So it definitely is oversized. I still want it to be big, but I just like just went down one size. I was like, mm, we'll see about an 18. And I'm glad I did. I feel like it fits really good, really comfy. It's going to be great. It's really long. It was longer <laughs> when I put it on with that skirt. It was longer. So I definitely could wear this with that skirt to kind of help hide the booty. Um, obviously, I'm still going to have the issue in the front, but the skirt's definitely shorter in the back because I have more booty than I have belly. <laughs> I'm trying to think of how to say that right. Uh, but this is very cute, very comfy, very high quality. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. I don't think I've ever met a Boohoo cardigan that I didn't like. Um, the next thing we're talking about is this little hat, tiny fedora. Most of the hats that I usually get have a wider brim, so I thought that I would try something a little bit smaller. Um, I have a big old head. A big old head. So I do have to struggle to kind of get this on. I think I'm gonna have to strategically place my weave when I want to wear this because of the clips right here. It doesn't want to push down all the way, uh, but you'll see it in the try on too because I tried it on. This is very cute. It did get kind of squished in the bag, so it does kind of get a little wonky, but I'll just let it sit and it'll be fine. I had something a little bit smaller for a nice hat for fall. Again, I have such a big head. If you don't have a big head, you're probably gonna love this. It was so affordable that I was like, I'll just give this little hat a go. Um, she cute. I mean, even if she sits like that, that's fine. She's not down all the way, but I'll just make my hair extra big and it'll just like offset. It'll be fine. No one will know. No one will care. I don't care. I like a little black hat, you guys. I really do. We actually got a few accessories. So I'm going to show you the boots really quick. You guys have been wanting me to try something different and try shoes. I saw on Boohoo that they had wide shoes and I had no idea that they did. When it comes to boots especially, I definitely need a wide fit. These, I would say they are wide, but they're not like overly wide. I feel like sometimes the wide shoes that I get it toward are too wide for my foot. My foot is pretty wide. It's a pretty wide foot, a pretty chunky foot. But I do have one ankle. It's my ankle that has way more arthritis in it. And like, and I heard it a long time ago. So when I got my arthritis, like it's way more sensitive and it's literally swollen every day of my life. So one of these in my, the one on my swollen, ankle doesn't quite zip up all the way. It's very, very close. It zips to about there. You'll probably see it in the try on in the split screen. It is different for me to walk in a heel. These guys are a UK size eight, a US size 10 wide. I'm going to try and get used to walking in them. I want to try and get some flat ones, uh, but I just saw these and I thought the velvet was so cute and I like the little tiny tassel and anything with black and gold. I'm just like, I love me some black and gold. So I just thought these were super cute. We say cute too much here on my channel. If you're, if you've been around for a while, you know. She cute, she cute. Uh, Shannon's clumsy, so we'll see how the heel goes, but I'm trying. I definitely, if you guys have a place where you've got some like flat wide width boots, I definitely just need to like splurge and like buy some from Torrid because I know they'll be wide enough and I'd rather honestly have my boots too wide. When it comes to flats, they I need them not to be too wide, but boots I like when there's a little extra room. Oh girl, she back with the ditzy print. This guy is so stinking cute, you guys. So cute. I live for like a baby doll top. Anything that has an empire waist and flares out over my belly, it just, I live, I live, I live. It's the same kind of fabric. It's super comfy. This again is a US size 18, a UK 22. And if you look really closely, I didn't realize this, but I love it so much more now. There's like pumpkin colored orange in the floral print. Yes, fall. Yes, fall. Yes, girl. I absolutely love this. I'm glad that I got the 18 and not 20 because I feel like the 20 would have been too big. And they're just so stretchy and comfy that honestly, you probably could size down if you wanted to in any of these. I think that I would have been fine with a 16. I think the 18 is a really good size for you right now. I do have a smaller bust for my size, so keep that in mind. If you have a larger bust, you might want to stick to your true size. Uh, but I definitely think that it runs true to size. Cute, which can be cute with a little waist belt, which you'll see I also tried on. I got some little belts. I'll just show you that now. This little three pack of skinny belts 
belts in the plus size. I guess it kind of makes sense that these belts don't run super big uh, because their plus size range only really does most of the time go to a US 20, sometimes to a 24. I think if you're a US 24, these probably won't fit because uh, I got mine on. I'd probably get it a couple notches tighter than I had it, but I don't like it to be too tight on my belly. So I just kept it on the biggest one. Uh, but they came with a like camel color and then a white one and a black one. There's white and black. And they're just skinny little belts. They were super cheap. It was like six bucks or something ridiculous for all of them. Uh, so I was like, why not? I never use skinny belts. I always have wider belts. So I thought it would be something a little bit different for me. And I just, I was really eyeballing this guy, the camel colored one, because I love wearing black, like, but for fall, I just love like tan. So I thought it would be really cute with this top. So that's why I tried it on together. Okay. This is the second time I've ordered these pants. I think it was not my last boohoo haul, but the one before where I got these and I was so worried because I'm so used to pants running too small. So I just like didn't know what to do. So I got them in a 22. So when I reordered them, I was feeling good. Good. I ordered an 18 especially because the 22 was so big and you guys I probably could wear a 16 like you guys have seen this there's so much room in the booty these are the most generously sized jeggings I've ever seen ever they are so comfy so stretchy it feels like I'm wearing leggings like maybe a little bit stiffer than leggings but these are like true jeggings but they look like you're wearing real pants they have the slits in them I feel like anytime I always have bad luck with black skinny jeans with rips in them. Anytime I've ordered them from Fashion Nova, I have had not good luck. I do have a haul coming up from Fashion Nova where I think I ordered another pair, but I really do love Fashion Nova's new sizing. So keep that in mind if you're gonna order, if you're plus size and you're gonna order from Fashion Nova, their plus jeans in the numbers, like they have plus 20, plus 22, stuff like that. Those are much more consistent and much more true to size than their 1X, 2X, 3X. Just keep that in mind. But these are so cozy and I cannot believe like, girl, it makes you want to order a 16 just so I can be like, mm, girl, I'm in a 16. I don't need to. I won't. I'm honestly going to try and shrink them a little bit, but they're not so big that like I can't wear them. But the 18, I mean, it's definitely workable. I like how they fit. I'm okay with it being a little bit extra roomy. Plus, I feel like there's less lumps and bumps when your jeans aren't too tight. So I really love these. I think I'm going to be wearing these a ton for fall. These were super affordable. I think they were like $16 plus slash rip jegging. 10 out of 10. Okay, this next top, I know it's a weird color. What color is this considered? Earth. <laughs> So this is the plus basic ribbed oversized t-shirt in earth. This is a US size 18, a UK size 22. I just thought it was a cute little basic shirt. I like how the sleeves rolled over. I just thought it was a basic, but I really liked the color. I felt like it was a color you don't really see all that often. I love the like ugly fall colors. I love it. I love it. Like, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, mustardy like yellowy browns and like yellowy greens and stuff like that i just love 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 all the time but i especially love in fall i think it fits pretty nicely it is a little bit clingy i'll probably just wear a t-shirt or i mean excuse me i'll probably just wear a tank top under it to kind of help alleviate all of the because it'll put another layer between my jeans and my shirt so i feel like that might smooth it out a little bit really cute fits nice we have another accessory in this little bag. This I had the hardest time trying to get on with my nails, but guess what? I just broke a nail, so I chopped them all off really quick because, girl, broke this nail, right? This one, I'm not trying to flip you off, but I busted it and I was like, oh girl. So I chopped off my nails really quick. But when I was trying to put this on, I did have nails, so it was really difficult. This is not a plus size choker, it's just a regular basic one. Um, and I knew I was risking it, it was super cheap. I just wanted a basic velvet choker, um, just for fall, cause I love it. I'm probably gonna have to have someone help me put it on because with my chubby neck, I definitely am gonna have to put on one of the very last, very last ones, which is kind of difficult to do myself, especially I have arthritis in my hand, so it's always difficult for me to fasten stuff. I might just get an extender to make it easier on myself so I can pull it past and then clip it, because trying to pull it like right there on your chubby neck is really difficult. Um, but I mean, it's just a cheap choker. It was a couple bucks. I'll make it work. Oh, okay, so next we're gonna talk about the t-shirt that I am wearing. It just says, adventures are forever, follow the sun. I love their t-shirts. Their t-shirts are always so comfy and they're always like a really nice material, very soft. Always a decent quality too. If it says it's oversized, it's gonna be oversized. I just, I'm, I love, I love. They have so many shirts that kind of have suns and moons on them and every single one that I've ordered, I've loved them all. Honestly, I don't think I've ever got a t-shirt from Boohoo that I didn't like. This one again is in a US 18, a UK size 22. And I thought I'd get the white one. I almost got the black one, but I was like, get 
out of your black box, Shannon. But I do love black for like October and fall. I like dressing a little more spooky. Um, I live for like suns and moons and like the witchy kind of vibe. <laughs> I know you guys have probably noticed that. I'm like so two ends of the spectrum. I love like pastel, lace, baby doll, bubble gum, strawberry shortcake. <laughs> and then I'm like witchy, Stevie Nicks, castles moons pentagrams like I don't 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 I don't know blame hot topic for that part of me um but I've always loved it I've always like I grew up loving hocus pocus I grew up loving halloween um it's just a thing I love skulls clearly that I feel like this background is definitely a representation of me <laughs> with like the cutesy skull like marbled skull and the flowers it's just something that I enjoy uh let's keep going Anyway, that was a long explanation. Not too much more to say about it. I really like it so much that I kind of still, I kind of want the black one too. All right, next we have some leggings. These are the plus slash front leggings. And these ones I got in a 20. These I ordered a while ago. Same with the jeggings, honestly. And I left them in the package for like a couple months. They're both still in stock though. As right before I filmed this, I double checked and both were still in stock. So I just threw them in this haul because I feel like they're great for fall and I definitely am going to be wearing them for fall. Honestly, I feel like right now I could have gone down a size in these leggings. They're kind of that awkward way where I have really thick calves. So sometimes pants, if they're too big around the waist and they're tight on the calves, I feel like they're going to fall down. Um, I don't feel like these are going to just like drop down, but I feel like as I'm walking, they are going to work their way down. So I'm just going to have to wear them, hopefully stretch out the calves a little bit from wearing them. And then I think that they'll be a little more comfortable. Uh, but I really like the slashes. I love that they're leggings and they you know, look like pleather pants. I just, I love leather leggings. I own so many pairs and I feel like no matter what they're never really that comfortable. Even the ones from Torrid, which I live for Torrid leggings, I just feel like pleather leggings are pleather leggings. You know, you get you get what you get. <laughs> um, but these are not bad at all. They're a nice thickness. They're not like too thick, but they're not too thin either. I feel like when pleather leggings are too thin, I'm worried I'm gonna like pop my nail through or something. I don't feel that way with these. Yeah, really comfy little waistband. I'm a, guess what? I'm a fan. They cute. Um, I think that these are going to be really fun to wear with all sorts of things in fall. I just love ripped denim, ripped leggings. I just... All right, you guys. This sweater is the whole reason I placed the order. I saw this and I was like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. But of course, I prolonged and then they sold out of my size in the sweater. So I did end up picking this up in a US 16, a UK 12. 20. So this one is the size 16. The only bummer is there is a hole, like it's a really chunky knit. Um, I'm going to email them. I'll let you guys know down like once I talk to them. This video will probably go up before I even hear from them or remember to email them. Let's get real. It's not the end of the world. I could stitch it, but it does have a little hole. I have heard that they're really good customer service. I've never had to return anything. Well, I'm a turd and back in the day I never returned anything. I'm getting much better at that. I'm trying really hard <laughs> to get better at returning stuff, but I love the sweater. And even if they're, it's probably out of stock now knowing the sweater because it was selling so fast. If it is like, I'm fine. I will just keep this. Like I will make it work because I love the color. It's not going to be a hard fix. Um, it still works as a size 16. I would prefer a size 18 because it would be a little more roomy and I love oversized cardigans. I want all of the fabric encasing me all the time. But I just love the knit on this. I love how chunky it is. I love the color. This came in other colors as well. I had to get the bright orange first. It is a little more bright than I thought it was going to be, but definitely not so bright that I won't wear it. Just says orange, the color. I thought it was going to be more of a burnt orange. I don't know why. Maybe in my mind, I just imagined it would be. Um, I feel like it looks even brighter on camera but I don't know I just I think this is super cute I will wear it I will love it fall I love you okay guys would it be a fall haul if there wasn't some plaid would there be no Shannon lives for plaid plaid is like my go-to in the fall I love having a little bit of plaid I live for a plaid dress I have a really cute um buffalo check dress that reminds me a lot of this one from Chic Soul. Love that. Love that. I think that they still have it or something similar, uh, but I thought I would try this little guy. I love their little, what are these called? Smock dresses. Oh my gosh. I have so many smock dresses from Boohoo. They're all so comfy. So cute. This one again is in a size 18. Um, I've gotten them all in size 20 in the past and they were just like a little bit loose. So I decided to go with 18 this time and I'm glad I did. I think it fits pretty much perfectly. Um, I have a long torso. So sometimes stuff that is like this, 
that has kind of a short empire waist where I feel like it's supposed to go just on your bust, doesn't fit quite right. But the stretch on this makes this fit pretty much perfectly. It's a nice length. I like how there's kind of a blue in the plaid and it's kind of a brighter blue and not like such a dark blue. It's a nice thin t-shirty material so it's gonna be real comfy. So this one is a really good one. She cute. I like her. There are all different, all different patterns and all different colors in these smock dresses on there. So if you like this style, you'll definitely have so many options. All right, loves, so that is everything that I picked up this time from Boohoo. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. This is honestly one of my favorite hauls I think I've ever done in my whole life. I just love, love, love fall and I'm so ready for it. So ready for it this year. I just, I love cardigans. I love leggings. I love ripped jeans. I love plaid. Um, I love all of those things. So I'm very excited for it to be fall. I'm hoping to bring you guys quite a few more fall hauls and I definitely am going to make it out to the stores to do some in the dressing rooms to try on some fall stuff. So definitely let me know down below what you want to see, where you want me to go. we would definitely go to Torrid. Um, I want to go back to Old Navy. I haven't seen some pictures of some really cute stuff. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and share if you could. And do remember that everything is linked down below and it would mean the world if you could use those links. No pressure, but it would be great for Boohoo to know that I sent you. Um, I think that's everything. I love you guys so much. I will talk to you soon. Hey, the price. Like there are certain sides of there. Blah, blah, blah. Strategically, if I can speak, I need a nap, guys. <laughs> plus size boots. Plus size boots, what? <laughs>